What's so special about an 8 megapixel camera? The raison d'etre of the Samsung Innovate is its 8 megapixel camera function. We could obviously talk about the Symbian 60 software and the keypads and the bright screen and the music player and FM and GPS and everything else. But come on, it's a hardcore camera phone. So it belongs in a photo studio, which is why I'm in a photo studio where my good friend Madhavan Pillay, editor of Better Photography, is going to join me in this review. Welcome to the show, Madhavan. Thank you. And uh, when I first spoke to you over the phone and proposed that you do a photo shoot with a mobile <laughs> phone camera, you laughed like Gabbar saying this. Like, <laughs> seriously. And so, uh, I mean, do you still think the same or you think we can go ahead and shoot with a mobile phone? Oh, absolutely. Look at this. Look at this and look at this. There's a big difference between a uh, camera phone and yeah. a professional digital this camera. This pretty much looks like a toy in front of this huge absolutely. Armageddon I, camera. I don't believe that this can actually do the trick at all. But why is that? What's the fundamental difference? If you look at the camera module of this cam phone, you'll see how small the lens really is. Uh, absolutely. This lens. Uh -huh. uh, the sensor here is actually as smaller than my little thing on here. Absolutely. And this has a pretty large sensor. That okay. makes the primary difference. Okay. Okay. This and this. Fair enough. You definitely can't compare a mobile phone camera to a digital SLR camera. That's like comparing apples to missiles. Anyway. <laughs> so to play it fair, I'm carrying a Kodak digital camera, a point and shoot camera, M863, which is an 8 megapixel camera. And typically mm -hmm. these uh, convergent devices like Samsung Innovate over here are trying to I wouldn't say dethrone, but totally replace the point and shoot camera category, which is the whole purpose of, let's say, a convergent device. Absolutely. Who would, who would even believe that it would come up to 8 million pixels at I this know, point? A couple of years back, we would have never thought that Absolutely. 8 million pixels Correct. in a camera phone. So, which is why uh, we're going to be comparing the results of pictures taken with all these three cameras, typically because all of them have 8 megapixel resolution. And we'll tell you what that whole myth about the megapixel count is all about. But for now, I'm going to hand over these cameras to you. And all the best for shooting. Are we ready for it? Absolutely. Lights, camera, action. So however much Ankit may insist that we use studio lights to shoot his cell phone camera, we can't. Who uses a cell phone camera in a studio anyways? Although this camera has got some really, really cool features, because it is also a phone, it has no optical zoom, and that just kills it for me. You know, one of the things about this phone is that it's got a shutter lag which basically means it doesn't shoot exactly when I click. Well, the shoot seems to be going pretty well so far, apart from the fact that Madhavan seems extremely agitated, A, because the camera just doesn't fill his hands enough, like a DSLR, and it brings back memories of him using his camera phone for some rather scandalous MMSs. Never mind, let's take you through some of the cool features that we found out in our review of the Samsung Innovate. The Samsung Innovate is a good-looking sliding handset. It definitely feels like a high-end phone with solid construction. The stylish cam phone comes with a whopping 16 GB of space and with option of expanding into 32 GB with memory cards. The Innovate works on the more popular Symbian operating system and Series 60 user interface. Apart from the mundane office functions like calendar and clock, the Innovate offers business users some handy features like quick office, PDF reader and zip application. What's really handy though is a smart reader application that utilizes the camera very efficiently to capture business card information and text from documents and stores it in an editable format. The Innovate is well equipped with all the necessary connectivity options from the standard USB 2.0 to Bluetooth with A2DP. Innovation, however, doesn't end with the camera. The standard S60 music player sounds much better on the Innovate. The sound is loud and clear. Being a multimedia handset, the Innovate delivers quite well. The handset comes with DivX and XVID video format support. Only you will have to convert files with the bundled DivX converter in order to watch them. Flipping over to the camera, the rear of the handset looks more like a compact digicam than a cell phone. The 8 megapixel autofocus camera is feature rich and has plenty of settings. In spite of all the features that with, the battery doesn't let you down. 
The phone lasts for a good three and a half hours of talk time alone. Forty-six thousand for the handset that has begun the war of the digicam versus the camera phone. So tell me, how was the shooting, Madhavan? Uh, let me compare the three uh, products now. You know, the uh, uh, DSLR obviously I like because it's got manual modes, it's got a lot of functions, I can fire my flashes with it. It's a photographer's camera. It is a photographer's camera. Yeah. The compact camera is a little too pink for my taste. Okay, but I'm sure Tanaya would like it because next time you go to China House or Zenzi, am I going to flash out your pink camera and click yeah, your pink? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, but, but the nice thing about that, it's nice, it's stylish, it's, it's compact. Yeah. You know, and it does the job. I think that's the most Absolutely. important thing. What about the Innovate? Pictures. The Innovate, I was not very, very comfortable with because um, it had certain uh, problems. You mentioned like the shutter, shutter lag. The shutter, the shutter lag was, uh, was a big problem. Also, there was no uh, optical zoom, so I could not zoom and I had to go very close to the subject. Yeah. You know, so it's definitely not a professional camera. But and then I'm again, sure my tons of SMSs and missed calls also disturb your shoot to an extent. Yes, it did. It did. <laughs> it's it's a all, all your girlfriends who okay. came all from, all, from all over the country. Can't help it. <laughs> One in every port of call. Okay. Yes.